Now, I'm going to be working with a girl tomorrow that they don't want to cash because I guess when she cashed before, her register was short a couple of times. Because it would have sounded drastic to say she cashed once and her register was short and they didn't want her to, um, to cash. Welcome to my channel. If you guys are new, my name is Jadine, and if you guys are not new, you guys know who I am. It is night time right now. It's currently 11.42, so almost midnight, and I'm getting ready to go to bed because I have another nine-hour shift tomorrow, and those are not exactly fun because it's a long day, and that's going to be like my second day back at work, and oh, I already feel so stressed that I'm not even there yet. My twists look atrocious right now. In the morning, I'm probably going to put it up like this and then let these two twists down like I did the other day because that is easy right now and right now we need easy. I think at the end of this week, I'm also going to like wash my hair and just put it up in a bun just to make life easier on myself. Right now is not the time for wigs because it's hot and with this type of heat, you definitely don't want to be playing around with no wigs because that bad boy will sweat right off of you, okay? I'm just imagining what... uh tragic day tomorrow is going to be because oh this new system isn't really working out for me like we're all the way at the front of the store I have to run all the way to the back to go to the restroom if I want to and then um like running back and forth to get things for people because nobody is allowed inside of the stores yet that's a lot of a tragic too so I'd say I'm definitely going through it and then I'm gonna be working with a girl tomorrow that they don't want to cash because I guess when she cashed before her register was short a couple of times because it would have sounded drastic to say she cashed once and her register was short and they didn't want her to um to cash she cashed a couple of times and her register was short which I don't know how because I feel like when it comes to people's money I'm definitely like on it like I'm checking your change twice and I'm definitely checking the money that you give me because I'm not trying to pay nothing back like in terms of like if I get like a fake bill and I'm definitely not trying to pay it back at the end of the day because my drawer was short so me that girl and another guy is going to be working tomorrow and the guy and I pretty much take turns when it's time to like work the register and whatever so um there's that and then of course the manager supervisor whatever he is he also helps with the register here and there so tomorrow should be a little bit easier considering the fact that it's going to be three of us there plus him so let's hope so but where the standing is concerned i don't think that's going to get any easier it's just i feel like that one day really just shocked my system because i went from pretty much laying on the couch or like laying in bed for so long to like went back to work and then so it looks like everybody else is trying to bank off of the unemployment and not want to like come back so it's just the three of us for right now well, everybody else is at home saying they have coronavirus, so who knows? I feel like they'd really be out here lying. Even though I'm not going to lie, like today, this morning when I woke up, I felt some type of way, but I felt like my body was just tired from yesterday. Like yesterday was so new to my body. I was just so tired. This morning I woke up thinking I may have had coronavirus, so I texted my husband and I was just like, do you think I may have caught coronavirus from just being out one day? And he was just like, um, no, I don't think so. <laughs> after seeing it i realized how ridiculous it sounds but like just how i felt when i woke up and i feel like the way how things are going right now you can't even be like yeah no definitely not we don't know at this point so hopefully in the morning when i wake up i don't feel the way how i felt today and i really have a routine down where i like wake up and like jump straight into my workout here in the living room and then i like um, shower and then make breakfast but what i think i'm gonna do is i'm gonna make breakfast first so i'm gonna work out then make breakfast then i'm gonna shower because yesterday when i made when i showered first and then made breakfast i was a little bit hot and i didn't really like that i like to feel fresh when i'm walking out the door especially because we are in the hot season so like before you know it you're hot as hell I need to get an air conditioner for this living room too because we do spend a lot of time in here and it really be hot. Right now the fan is going, but sometimes when it's so hot, it really feels like you're better off turning the fan off because it, it's pushing out hot air too. Today, I yesterday when I came home, I said that I was going to wake up this morning, go on a walk, come back and work out. That did not go as planned because 
my alarm went off at 8 o'clock, but I went back to sleep because I was so tired. And then when I woke up, I felt like I did enough yesterday. Yesterday, I did enough walking for like two days. I doubled the amount of calories that I normally do on like a regular day when I wasn't going to work. So I'm just like, yeah, I'm not really going to pressure myself right now. Like, that's fine. And when I go back tomorrow, I'm going to be working for the next three days. So tomorrow, the other day and the other day, and then I'm off the next day. And then, like, after this week, things are going to slowly start going back to what it normally is. I think next week we're going to still be opening half an hour later and closing um, 45 minutes earlier. But, like, hopefully after that, things start going back to normal and it's more staff and all that. Because this right now is tragic, okay? But, um, yeah. The eating, I had told you guys about it the other day, that, um... I've been sticking to my intermittent fasting where I wake up and I still don't eat. When I made the breakfast the other morning, I brought it with me just in case I needed it. And I ended up eating half of the sandwich when I was eating my lunch. Because the lunch was like a smaller portion that day because I'm trying portion control too. And I ate half of it when I was eating the lunch and I ate the other half when I came home at like almost 8 o'clock. So I think I did pretty good. So if I keep that up, we should be looking good out here in the streets, okay? So that's what's up. I, the other, damn, I've been talking for six minutes. The other day too, when um, the manager was changing like the little shift because the initial shift that we went back on, he kind of changed that quickly because another girl said she had coronavirus. So he had to change it. And then um, I was telling him like, I feel like I, I just want to work two Sundays and two Saturdays out of each month because I feel like it's only fair that there's a rotation. I don't see why I should be stuck on every single weekend when I did not agree to working every single weekend when I signed the papers up and stuff. It's okay if everybody is rotated so I can be home on a Sunday and a Saturday too because I'm not going to lie, this time being home for so long, especially on Sundays, like I actually like being home on a Sunday. So I told him about that and I'm definitely going to keep reminding him because they're not going to roll over on me down there. However... I'm going to go to bed right now and put my watch on the charger and my phone and I think I'm going to lay down for a little bit and try to like wind it down. I'm probably not going to fall asleep that instant, but I'm at least going to lay down because it's 12 o'clock and I need to go to sleep so I can get eight hours of sleep to be able to work tomorrow. Hi guys, so I'm currently in the lunchroom eating lunch and so far, right now it's 2.34. Today is not as tragic as yesterday was, but um, everybody is kind of freaked out. Um, one, today me and my coworker were talking and I was just like, people could commit so much crime right now because everybody's wearing masks and it's super freaky outside because you don't know who is who because of the masks and everything, but it's a safety thing. So, you know, we love, but everybody is so upset because they can't get to come inside of the store yet to like see the things that they want and they're just mad as hell. But I just had lunch and honestly, I feel tired. I can't wait to go home and then just relax a little bit especially because i gotta be back here tomorrow and the day after so i just need to go home and like relax but i'm on lunch right now it's i think i have like 10 minutes left so i'm gonna just sit here and like rest my feet for the next 10 minutes and then go back out and complete the rest of my shift so it's night time i've been home for a while looks like we're doing this thing at night i've been home for a while and honestly my legs my the sole of my feet were really, really hurting. Like, oh, I don't want to ever be out that long again because my body takes too long to get used to working again. And I don't necessarily like that. Like, that's not my favorite thing. It just makes life harder for me. So today was a pretty smooth day. Like, it was okay compared to the very first day. I'm just tired and... I know that I'm probably not going to be up tonight until 12 o'clock because I, I was still doing that because um, the way how the body is set up, she's not going to allow that. My throat is actually hurting. Like I felt it today and I took a Cepasol because I always have those now and it helped a little bit until the Cepasol was like all gone and then I felt it again and like right now when I swallow like I can feel it and I, I really don't like that. As much as the Cepasol helps, like, I wanted to just go away and stay away. Like, I don't, I don't like this at all. And I haven't said anything yet because I don't want to alarm anybody, but I'm low-key kind of worried because I'm just like, all right, well, what is this exactly? You know? What do we have going on here? <laughs> I don't like this. 
Today I had some sweet potatoes for lunch and they were so, so good. And this time I did them in the microwave as opposed to the oven because when I was meal prepping, the oven was occupied. So I had to use something else and the only thing that was available was the microwave. And I remember hearing before now that you could um, bake them in the microwave and my microwave has a setting for actual potatoes and love that. It really, really worked out. I'm trying to... Um, I'm trying not to think about my throat too much because I'm just like, I don't want to wake up tomorrow and it feels worse. Even though my manager said to me today that he's going to be making sure that everybody leaves early one of the days. So my leave early day is either going to be tomorrow or Friday evening. I wouldn't mind if it's Friday evening because I'm off Saturday. So that would have really, really worked out for me. Like I'd get off early Friday evening just to be off Saturday again. Would love that. But, not really counting on it, because this is me we're talking about, you know. <laughs> Anyways, I just wanted to pop in and end the vlog. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. And I will see you guys in the next one.